Happy New Year's, everybody! Woo! So yeah, I ever since the start of this year, I've been completely sick. Well, not completely sick, but every single night, I just end up with allergies. Allergies that don't stop from killing me. Even if even if I take pills, the pills don't cure them. Like especially the 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 pills that I take almost every night, so it doesn't happen. It doesn't affect me anymore. It doesn't cure me. I'm dead. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, I'm finally back. I feel a lot much better. Um, my my art block stopped for a bit because I was having a, an art block. I was try I was going to many job interviews. I, I was. Uh, Doing my schedule like finding a way to do commissions do tutorial for YouTube and work on my comic in which I plan to release it um, on May At Puerto Rico Comic Con 2018 so those who are watching that are from Puerto Rico I will see you there. I will be having a, a booth um, And I'll be selling a comic My first comic to be honest well, I, I would say my first comic publicly, because I used to have a lot of comics, but I never actually made one, uh, you know, for for the world to see. You know, the the comics uh, the comics I used to do were actually just for myself, and that's it. So yeah, um, today it's the day we finally got to the moment that we were waiting for, the body tutorial. Now, there, there's a note that I made. So, as you all know, you... Okay, there's a few steps for this. And it's going to be a little bit hard. Because you will need to know how to do the head and the pointer. So, if you already saw the, the other two videos, welcome to this video. This is the, continu the continuation of... Of the other two <laughs> without the I mean you don't need it but you do need how to do you do need to know how to do the heads <laughs> there we go so uh, we're gonna start again as everyone knows I'm using paint to sigh and um, for your prep preparations you can use whatever you like um, so yeah, let's start with the head. Let's see. Okay, it's working. Sometimes my, my pen doesn't work. It's kind of stupid. Uh, the size doesn't matter. Should try, try always the resolution on 300. That's it. That's all I can tell you. Okay, so let's start. Like I said before, we got to start with the head. Remember the circles? Yeah, you do. So, okay, now we're going to do the pointers. Um, let's see, let's always make them look to this side, so like that. Okay, you'll know, you guys already know how to make the head. I already showed you on a, on a, on a video. You can go head. It's probably on the... Every day, every day, every day. It's taking my time of drawing. <laughs> okay, so yeah, everyone already knows. Make the head. I'm gonna start with the furry head. Or, yeah, the furry head. I'm gonna start with the furry version. So I might have uh, I might have the skips or anything. Even though, no, let, let's just make a furry anime head, which is, which is better. Do you, do you guys know two kinds? Well, that, that kind, that kind of, uh, that kind of style where the, yeah, the nose is over here and the mouth is like, it, it's basically an anime, anime, uh, kind of comic kind of style. Like it, it, it 
the the furry kind the the furry style doesn't doesn't move too much. Okay, anyways, uh, there we go. We we have the head. We have the head. There we go. Okay, so let's make the the eyebrows. Remember that the eyebrows are supposed to be this way. Ah. Allergies, can you stop please? I'm trying to teach people here. Anyways, okay, so uh, remember to do the eyebrows like this. Like, always make like there's an eyebrow there. Like, don't make a line. Because, <laughs> oh man, a line is not an eyebrow, okay? The only reason an eye, a line can be an eyebrow is if they paint it off. Like if, if they just, I have an eyebrow now. <laughs> okay, let's make, let's make the ear. Um, I mean, I, I should skip this because it's, it's part of the head, but I don't want all of you to miss anything so I'm just gonna keep it here we can do the hair at the end like it, do it doesn't matter it could it could be done now or it can be done and it could be done later but I, I can I can like make this I guess there we go okay and remember the the neck yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. You do remember the neck. There you go. And I'm gonna sneeze again. BRB. Ah, oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Ah, uh, you flew away. Great. Thank you, sneeze. I probably have to speak more so I don't sneeze. <laughs> so I'm gonna speak more. Okay, so you now... Okay, no. I can't. I can't speak like that. Okay, so now that we are here, this is the step that we we were waiting for. Uh, we already made the neck, we already made the head, we already make everything. Now the point is to make the, the body. Now, and I know that people can't do this on a paper, so just try if you're working on a paper with a pencil. Obviously, not with a pen. If you do it with a pen, uh, you're, you're, you're messing it up. <laughs> um, but you can do it on a pen, of course. I mean, uh, if you do it on, on a pen, just remember that you can... Uh, it actually helps you on not to mess up too much, which is, in a way, it's good. It's good. But that's, that's on you. Uh, I prefer you use a... a a pencil so you're able to you know erase like what I'm doing control C is like erasing in a way anyways okay um, now we're gonna start with the with the body now what way the body will be you know facing right now it's going to be facing this way this way right well, if we if we make a 3D a 3D arrow, it would be more this way, right? Something like that. But the body would okay. Looking at the neck, because you can you can actually fix that later on, not on paper, of course, <laughs> but on digital, you can actually you can actually fix. Uh, where the body is going to be. So, uh, looking at the head like that, I would say that making a, a line like this would actually tell me where the body's or how the body is going to be from top to bottom. Um, also, by the way, I forgot to say this. Uh, this tutorial is only about the chest on uh, onto the like from the chest to the crotch like I'm not gonna do any tutorial on the arms yet and neither to the feet because you have to do the body first and then do the arms and the feet and I want you guys to take your time 
on knowing what to do with with the body first okay now um, knowing where the chest is you're gonna the the bottom part of the chest you're gonna line it up it's mostly like over here just try it like to uh, measure it but on the, the on the drawing this is so so much math and science right <laughs> Is math related to science? Huh? Who knows? Probably. <laughs> okay. So on the first step, we're actually going to do the shoulder line. The short shoulder line over here. Like that. Okay. It's basically just one or, or horizontal line. But knowing how how the head is like a little bit tilted. You're going to do the line a bit tilted as well. That's why I did it like that. Now, for the chest, we got we to gotta make a triangle. Connecting the shoulders onto the, the end of the chest. Where is, which is this part over here. And I'm going to sneeze. Uh, if I say that I'm going to sneeze. Oh, that does. I'm going to sneeze. I'm going to sneeze. So I don't sneeze. <laughs> Okay, so my parents went to bed. This is the only problem about me trying to uh, do, you know, do tutorials. I need to speak loud because it's the only way I can take everything from my mind. If I speak too low, I'll end up brain farting and that's not what I want. So I'm just going to try and speak as loud as I can, but as low as I can. <laughs> Okay, so now we're going to do the shoulder line. I mean, we already did the shoulder line, sorry. The chest triangle. The chest triangle is actually where... I mean, I already explained it. Uh, the two... the two Connecting the, the shoulder line into the chest, which that will tell us um, how big is the chest or... I mean, yeah, sure. Because uh, most of the times uh, we men have more shoulder, um, like wide shoulders, than than women. Women have less shoulders, and like they have more of an hourglass kind of triangle, and we can do that. Okay, so um, as a as a little pointer, as a little hint, as a little help, you can actually like make a circle on each point. Not on this one, because <laughs> we already have the line. So, um, since we have to do a triangle, we can do this. Right? There we go. We can make this the line as straight as ever. If you can't do a straight line, remember to do them fast. Do not do them slow, because it will look horrible. And now, for the belly area, we, we have to make a circle. But we can't make that circle too big because the circle will not touch the crotch. Man, I, I don't have any other word to say from that part. The pelvis, yeah, let's call it the, pel the pelvis because every time I say crotch, it, it, it just, I just, I don't know, I just, it, feels, it feels weird saying it, you know, especially when there's kids around, you know. <laughs> Let's keep going. Anyway, okay, <laughs> we're gonna do a circle. Uh, not too big because um, mostly the crotch is going to be like over here. I said it again. I said it again. Ah, okay. So we did the circle there. It's fine. It's great. Now that actually tells us how how fat the character is. So you can actually make like a, a big circle like this. It can surpass the triangle, like it, it can be like on top of that triangle. Like, let me see if I can give an example here. Uh, yeah, like that. Okay, so let's say that the chest is over here. That's the belly. See how it goes? See how it connects? <laughs> so perfect. Okay. But this character is going to be skinny. We're doing the average. The average male weight, <laughs> average, average skinny people, 
I'm fat. <laughs> I'm an ugly fat man, and I'm proud of it. I'm ugly and I'm proud. Ugly and I'm proud. <laughs> SpongeBob related things. Okay. So there we go. We have the belly. There's the belly. I guess you can see you can you can actually like not make the belly uh, or just the body. You, you you can make like the body not not to uh, you know like hourglass if you don't want it. Anyways, now that we have to do the pelvis, the pelvis is actually more of a square rectangle uh, form, you know. So, um, knowing that this character won't have uh, big thighs or hips, then the square is going to be... I even forgot what I was saying. This is the bad thing about having allergies. I even forgot. Okay, so uh, I know it, it was a, a square. We were doing like a square rectangle form. Um, if you can do it um, in 3D, in a 3D version, it's even better. If you actually do it on a 3D version, which is just do this. So you can actually have a, a better way on how to do the front and the back. But since we're going slowly, we can we can do uh, we can do a 2D version. I don't want to go too far. There we go, okay. And that's it. That's actually all you need. Because um, the rest, it's hard to know how you want to do the body. Because let's just say uh, I, I want this character with, with big pecs. So there are going to be big pecs over here. Like so. Like that. Those are big pecs over there. Now we're going to do the body, the belly, the belly, so the belly is going to be this big, let's say the, the belly button is like over here, it actually depends on the arm, it's going to be this side, so you, you can actually do this X knowing where the middle of the arm is going to be, um, so that's the arm, then you do this, you did this. There you go. <clears throat> and then you have the body. Um, the only way you can know how to improve this is by keep practicing. Never stop practicing and you'll, you'll end up doing something even better than I can do. Because, let's just face it, I suck at drawing. <laughs> I'm just teaching you what I know because I've never took classes. I've been 11 years drawing by myself, and yeah, this is what I can actually give you. Now, seeing this, now you know where the pecs are going to be, where the belly is going to be, and where the hips are going to be, which is actually the, the most central thing that you must to know, and let's do the, let's do the... Let's do the, the things over here, the, the shoulders. I call them things, the things. So now you know that after here, there. Now I'm going to show you the, the, the arms and the legs on another tutorial because it's something, something else more complicated. And I plan to do at least the arms Completely, completely with the hands, so that way you can learn how to do the full arm, including the hand with all five fingers, or three, or four, or four, or three, <laughs> or, 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 or four, or four, or three, yeah, that's what I meant, <laughs> uh, but yeah, the reason I want I want to give you the hand tutorial uh, with the complete version of the arm is because I'm showing you each body step. 
I don't want to be like, okay, uh, you already know how to do the, the body and the head right now, right? And you can do the arm on yourself, but if I give you the tutorial with the arms and the full hand, you can actually do, uh, you can start doing by yourself, uh, you can start doing uh, like images of your character like this or like, you know, um, from chest up but with the full with the full arms or like doing this or something just that's the point <laughs> so the next tutorial it's how to do the arms now i was having a, an idea of you guys because I, I wanted you guys to give me like homework <laughs> but I, I actually was thinking about you guys should make um, Imgur, Imgur is it? Ikmer? Ikmer? Uh, the, the, the links to photos, um, and post them on the comments. Show me what you've done, show me how, how good have you done it, and just show me anything. Anything, it's, it's pretty great, I like seeing everyone's art, and I really appreciate all the support. And this time I can know that you guys know how to do homework. Because <laughs> I did the headshot of homework and nobody did it. And, I, and I'm paying attention. I'm, I'm paying attention to all of you. I saw. I saw the video. It has over almost 7,000 7, views. Do not. And you all, all 7,000 haven't gave me the freaking homework. I'm watching you guys. I'm going to give you an A. That's just for that video. On this video, I hope to see comments below with a lot of links with pictures of your drawings. I want to see everything, okay? Or not everything, just, just your drawings, please. <laughs> just your drawings. I want to see your drawings. I want to see what you learn from these videos. And yeah. I feel proud. <laughs> so wait a minute. <laughs> I forgot how to do the women's body. Yay. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm sorry. I'm going to do it right now. I'm going to gonna show you. So the same shorter line. Remember the shorter line. Um, this time, the women's body, um, the shoulders are... A bit more closer to the head I mean to the neck not to the head and they have an hourglass figure how is the hourglass I don't know if you've seen uh, the hourglass before which is something like this and then it has like like tons of sand over here and it falls down over here if you've seen Dragon Ball C, uh, Dragon Ball Super, you probably know what a, what an hourglass is. So we're gonna use the hourglass for this body because we're gonna do the women's, the women. We respect the women, so we're gonna do the women's body, the female version of the body. There we go. Okay, so we have the hourglass over here. I forgot to do the first line. Yeah, it's going to be like this. Okay. So the chest is over here, okay. So we're gonna do the hourglass, okay. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Now we're gonna do a small circle. Oh, this is uh, baby doll here because you know, we, we love those big beautiful women. <laughs> if it's a big beautiful woman, then the hourglass must be a little bit more. Uh, wait, we gotta do the circle first. The circle is mostly for uh, the movement that you have in the middle of your belly. You know, when you move up and down like, to the sides. That's, that's, that's what the circle does. So we have there, if it's a big, beautiful woman, uh, we, can make, we can make like a, a big right here, like this. And we have the, and there we have the hourglass. So as you all know, the 
Okay, always remember this. Uh, when doing the the woman's body, we don't do the the chest. You know the the two melons. We don't do we don't draw the melons first. We actually draw the whole body that is under the melons. <laughs> you know the 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 melons, the oranges, however you want. I don't know. Anyway, we we do the body first. So. Since this is a beautiful woman, we're going to do a little bit of chubbiness over here. There we go. <laughs> and we're going to do the hips. And then it ends over here. But I'm going to do this. And here's where the pelvis is. Ah, uh -huh. ah, uh -huh. yes. <laughs> so we're, here's the arm. We know the shoulder is over here, so the arm is going to be over here. Then we're going to do a little bit of chubbiness again, and then the rest. We're going to do the hips. There we go. There we go. And then we have the, the belly button over here. As you can see, now we got to do... Uh, the, the boobers, the, the melons, the, the, the oranges. Um, okay, so let, let's, we can do like a size comp, uh, a size, size comp, comparation, comp, uh, compare, we gotta compare the, the, the size of them. I don't know why we're doing this. Oh man, I feel so dirty. Oh no, oh no, I shouldn't. We shouldn't be doing this. Come on. Okay. So that's 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 one, right? They're 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 average. I could say average. I don't know. I want to say average. Please don't kill me for it. But that's the average size, I guess. I don't know. That's one size. So we start with a little curve over here like that. Just keep practicing it if if it if it seems too pointy on your side, um, try doing it again. Try try doing it round. I, most of the times, I've seen many artists where they actually like either do like a curve on the top, then do another curve, and then they do the, the full circle at the end. Something like that. Uh, I've seen artists in which they just make a little line over here. They and they like end up doing it more to the bottom. Then they do that. Like there's many shapes. It's really hard to even explain how to do a boob. <laughs> oh, man, I, f I even feel bad for saying that word on a family friendly channel. <laughs> so anyways, uh, that's the the. BBW version of the body, I guess. Now we're gonna do a skinny version. Um, since probably some many people like to draw skinny characters, they don't care about. They don't care about shabbiness. It's okay. It's okay. I don't care. I'm fat and happy. I really do not care. <laughs> okay. So there we go. We have the. See how the hourglass works? So, can you see like the sand over here and then going back down over here? <laughs> Anyways, so like I said before, we don't do we don't do the the melons first. We do the body first because the body is actually something separate from that. <laughs> Cause okay, I'm not gonna say anything. Anyways, okay, <laughs> we're gonna this okay the chest is over here the body is over here and then the hips there we go okay so knowing where the hand is going to be uh the the arm not the head there we go we can do like a little circle okay if you don't know that how to do this part just do either a circle or an oval like something that can tell you where the arm is going to be um it could be little it can be big I mean, either way, at the end, you're gonna, you, you'll know, you'll know how to do the arms. Sometimes, 
sometimes you you'll start the arm from here which it doesn't make sense but just do the circle so you know where the arm is going to be that's it so like ignore the reason that it's that is too big or something and yeah just ignore it um, I haven't got to that part yet arms are not part of this tutorial and that's it let's say the, the boobs are tiny small like lollies mostly lollies don't have like a shape over here I could I could be wrong I could make them a little bit like this I don't know so yeah there you have it see how it works that's how it works well guys thank you all for watching if you wish for more tutorials then give me a like and a subscribe also you can support my patreon watch early access to animation tutorials and speed paints see you later fuzzimators <laughs>